So last week I told you the story about how I got hit by a car while I was doing a training ride for all my cycling that I used to do when I lived in California for about five years. And the picture behind me, that's me coming in second place at the Burlingame Crit. If you don't know what a criterium is, that's when people basically ride around in a closed course for circles and circles for like an hour. It's ridiculous and I don't know why I ever wanted to do it. So anyway, I'd been riding, um, the guy hit me, another car pulled over to see if everything was okay and to see if it was gonna be a hit and run. So the guy who hit me actually ended up staying with me and I waved the other car on, which was kind of stupid of me, but I was just in so much shock. And remember I had my bicycle, I was like gripping it, I lifted it above my head and I was like, you didn't effing see me, I can't believe it. And some pain started to set in. So I stupidly get in this guy's car and we drive to the nearest hospital and I guess I trusted him because he's like this older gray haired, guy clearly kind of wealthy and now in hindsight i realized that that was all just really really stupid of me don't get in somebody's car call the police so guy has me in his car um we're driving to the hospital and out that his name is dennis and he lives in the area and so we just get to the hospital i start getting checked in and the receptionist looks at my id and says oh, is it too late to say happy birthday to you? Because this was like two or three days after my birthday on November 4th. So I guess I'm lucky that we even actually made it to the hospital and that he wasn't a serial killer or something. But anyway, um, I'm in my room, I'm all checked in and I'm waiting to get checked out to see if I have any broken bones. And I go ahead and call my ex-boyfriend because I figure he'll wanna know where I am and like why I'm not back at the hotel and all that good stuff. So I call him and the reception inside the hospital room is terrible. So I'm on the phone and I'm like, hey, can you come to this hospital? I got hit by a car. And he's just like, what? And so three more times I say, can you come to the hospital? I got hit by a car and begrudgingly he comes to the hospital.